G'day, it's Brian Duggan, BJ Constructions. Uh, just going to take you down and have a look at this retaining wall again. Um, as you can see, we've had 150 mil of rain over the last yesterday and last night. It's actually torrential poured down. Uh, it's just a bit of a break in the weather, and I thought I'd just have a look at the wall and make sure that, uh, things are going down here. So, um, very, very slippery. I've got to be careful. I won't go over on here. Again, down there, you can see um, everything's really green and wet and soaked. So, really had a bit of a damp wheel last night. See how it goes. Right, yeah, you can see. Yeah, have a look at that. Um, you can see that fence, that post there. She's on a bit of a lean. It's worse than it was the other day. Leaned right out. So, from where it was, and it's gone. You can see where those um, ones a bit further down there have been undermined and they're starting to lean forward. And you can see more soil has come out from underneath the um, the, uh, the wall over there where it's failed. And in fact, there's a bit more, well, you can't see through that tree, but I'll take a wander down there. we be very careful. Very, very careful. So, to bear with me while I get up here, I've got to hang on to this rope. <coughs> um, well you can have a look down this valley, look in the valley here, and you can see how wet everything it is. And the clouds up there, we've really had some rain, and there's more coming too, so I've got to just keep an eye on this. You can see here, these, all these are starting to go now. Um, the concrete on this footing's been washed away. The concrete on the footing, it's gone. And there's more soil that's coming out, it's sitting on top. This one over here, this next post, they're starting to get a lean on it now. And the concrete's been washed right away from it. So there's a little lean on that now. So it's right there. And here we go here, look. This is the next post. All the concrete footing exposed. On top of the concrete footing is the soil that's washing away. And we still see it as we go along here. here. Um, look at that soil that's come out of there now. Massive amount of soil that's come out of here. You can see it. Yeah, look in there. You can see all this all wet has come through there. Just shocking. And up the top, it's all washing away from in there. You see daylight through it now. That's a bad sign. You see daylight through the wall. And you can see these ones down here. They've had a bit of bad, even the big ones have gone right out further. So, we'll have a look at up here a bit. And you can see the other day, that termite bait that was there. Look how far it sunk down now. Unbelievable. So, We've all got a bit, just hope, just hope. So you've, all we've got there is just a piece of cement sheet blue board that they expect to hold the soil back, but it's right up the top. But if you look right in here, if you look right in there, that's where you can see inside the wall, and you can make it out, but there's daylight on the other side. So that's bad. And then that one there, it's gone too. <sighs> Termite City, it's just eaten everything in here. And uh, I just hope, you can see where the soil's look underneath the wall there, it's undermined. And you can see where it's coming, it just keeps washing out. And there's where it's washing down the hill. You can see the soil, it's, there it is down there, look. See? There's where the water's all uh, rushing it, washing it down here. It makes its own path. So it's washing it down, down into there. And uh, you further down, you can see some more soils that have, that have been washed down. So. It's in a pretty bad way, and let's just hope it holds out because this is deteriorating very quick. And uh, I'd hate to see anything really bad happen here, but we just try and get back up. Pretty, big, pretty hard going today, but it's not the way it is. But, um, yeah, look, just unbelievable. There'll be nothing left of these concrete footings soon. They're going to go. 
and that's starting to lean. The other one down there is leaning. They're getting by the day. There's more and more leans on them. So uh, all it's going to take is one to wall over. And you can see up beyond beyond those bushes up there, the soil's being washed away underneath the slab. I don't know if you can make that out, but it's just up the top. You can see the concrete slab is just the soil's been washed away. You can see underneath the slab there. And just got to get past this bit here. So you can see these, look at these posts. They moved in the last couple of days. They moved right out completely. That's just way too much weight behind that wall there to hold it. Way too much. And when you've got concrete footings you're supposed to be holding like that, they've got nothing to hold them there. It's only a matter of time. You can see where the water's just washed all this stuff away. It's been running away down the bottom. It's really bad. There's this one here, it's been washed down there, washed down there, washed, washed away. Well, anything that long grass is just disguising it a bit, but it's going all the way down. And this post here, look at the lean on it. The last couple of days, that's come out of about 100, 100 mil, 200 mil at the top. That's really, really bad. And um, so, and you can see where the soil's washing down the side of this right away here. It's washing it down there too. And also up in here. So that's the uh, council, the council uh, storm water pits, and it's washing the uh, sides of those away as well. While I was down there, so. This isn't very good at all. It's a very, very dire situation, and uh, um, all we can do is keep our fingers crossed that no one gets hurt or anything like that. But anyway, we'll see what happens in the next couple of days with it all. Until then, there's Brian signing out.